All right, guys, I'm going to be doing my favorite soup. It's uh, pea soup. I took four bags of peas. I soaked them overnight. And uh, I cut up ham. And four cans of home and two cans in each. Now I'm doing uh, crock pot cooking slowly while I go to work. I put it in two containers because I didn't have enough room. Uh, you know, I put garlic in there and salt and pepper. And oregano. What I'm going to do is cover these babies up. Both of them. I put them on this, these little pans underneath here in case there's any overspill, but I don't think so. I'll put them on low and cook them all day. When I come home, the soup should be done. So this is four bags of peas, two in each. I took half of a ham, a small little ham, and I cut it up into little chunks. So it's going to have, you know, chunks of meat in there. Two cans of small hominy, white hominy in each. This size can here, which is 15 ounces, so there's two cans in each, and you know, garlic and whatnot. So we'll cover them up, and I'll put them on low, and we'll let them rock and roll all day while I go to work. How are we working, man? Cook. All right, so I got that on low. I got that one on low. Let me cover it up. And see what happens when I come home later. a.m. right before work. That's what I'm going to do. We'll check it out. My favorite soup right here. This is my favorite. I'm out, so I like to cook in bulk and have it in the freezer and bring it out as I need it. Alright guys, just come home from work. We've been chooching all day. Needs a good stir, it looks like to me. This is it's not burnt, you know. Let it go all day and it's pretty much done. It's done. What's good about this is it's not burnt, you know, it won't burn at all. Just had it on low all day. Turn it off now. That's good, man. That's good. Nice and thick. Yum. Alright, I'm going to put the cover on. I'll take this one, stir this one, and then we'll be good to go. I'll let it cool and we'll get a bowl. It's kind of like a little foaming action that happens on the top, but. What happens with this is, um, after you shut it off and let it cool for a while, it'll get like a film on the top after you put it in the refrigerator. It'll get like a film on the top, and it's like a, it's almost like a gelatin type of film. We'll scrape that off, and the rest will be all ready to go. Nice. while I was at work. How were real working men cook? I'll shut that off and let this thing cool and we'll be good to go. What's good about the about the crock pot is um you don't burn it, man. You just let this thing go all day. It don't burn. I love this thing. This is my old, my old one. I'm gonna get a couple of bigger ones and do some different stuff with it. But that's it. 
What I'm probably going to do is transfer this into a one pot and put it in the refrigerator, let it sit overnight. Then what happens is on the top, I'll get like a like a film on the top, like a gelatin. I'll scrape that off, and all the rest will be ready to rock and roll for soup. Uh, be good, good to go. All right, guys, I transferred it all to this pot, and what I'll do is I'll put it in the refrigerator. And tomorrow there'll be like a gelatin on the top of this, and I'll scrape it all off, and I'll be all ready to put in for meals, for um, you know, to freeze and have for meals. But I'll get myself a little bowl together, and the rest of this will be, like I said, I'll prep this all, and um, that's how I usually do it. You let it set in the refrigerator overnight, and there'll be like a little, I don't know, quarter inch or three eighths of gelatin that will form on the top of the the soup and you just scrape that off and the rest of it's ready to rock and roll. This is by far my favorite soup in the world. The hominy, um, the peas and the um, ham. I just love this stuff. Come out great, guys. Came out great. Like I said, this is my favorite soup. You could put some crackers in there too if you want. Next level yum. Yummy. Got the ham, hominy, and the peas in there. It's great. If only mama could cook like this. If only mama could cook like this. And take her for a ride in the ice cream truck. Good stuff, man. Good stuff right here. That's my favorite meal right there. Now I could put crackers in there too if you want. But that's the deal guys. It's next level yum. Next level yumminess. How a real working man cook. Can't screw it up in a crock pot. Cook it all day. It don't burn or nothing. You can't screw it up with a crock pot. Crock pot cooking for real working men. There you go.